This pandemic has turned lives upside down, not just as far as health, but financially, as we've been mentioning here. And in these times, every dollar is important, especially for small businesses. Nick Sturdivant explains how one business in Clayton County is holding up. As a small business, you don't know what you're made of until adversity hits. Eric you know? Green owns Good News Barbershop in Jonesboro, but lately, Good News has been hard to come by since closing his doors more than a week ago. We, we closed up shop even before the county put something in place, and we just didn't know in what direction or how far or how close this thing could impact ourselves and our guests. It's a family-run business. It's been an adjustment, to say the least. You know, um, it's funny, man, that how, like, during these times where I should be thinking about myself and my family, I'm thinking about my clients. Good News Barbershop sits in the position that a lot of small businesses nationwide are now in desperate for help. Treasury Secretary Steve Mnuchin said Thursday that the program to help small businesses, which is a part of the $2 trillion stimulus package, would be up and running today, offering companies and nonprofits a low interest loan to cover up to two months of payroll and other expenses. Officials say most, and in some cases, all of the loan would be forgiven if the borrower retains workers and doesn't cut their wages, according to the Atlanta Business Chronicle. But there is some doubt. I've also heard uh, other smaller banks that I'm working with that they just don't have the capacity or uh, the guidance right now from Treasury. You know, no one has any clear guidance. Uh, we have applications on our desk. I'm not anxious, but I am concerned. We, we lead with integrity and, you know, we, we have our records and stuff um, in order. He offers so this advice to other businesses. Keep your ears close to the pavement in terms of uh, what you can apply for. Eric says he's thankful for the many people that have reached out during this time. He also says one organization made a small donation. Every bit helps.